guys, how's it going? Chess back again with another small mini transfer update video from the Chelsea career mode here on Xbox One. Now as you can see, just a quick note outside of uh, Chelsea career mode, Frank Lampard has retired from international football halfway through the World Cup. Of course, we uh, qualified from the group stage yesterday. That video went down very, very well indeed. Thank you for all the support on that. The, uh, the next video of which will be coming out tomorrow. But uh, yeah, Frank Lampard has retired from international football halfway through a World Cup. If uh, you follow me on Twitter, you'll have seen me raise at EA yesterday. So I was quite annoyed about that. But anyway, that's, uh, ju this is just kind of to keep you up to date with everything that's going on in the Chelsea career mode in the background whilst we're going through the World Cup with England. Because of course, uh, as we go through the knockout stages, it'll be one game per episode. So you'll be getting the uh, the second or the second round the first knockout round into your uh, sub boxes tomorrow afternoon there will of course been a video earlier today saying uh, or with a road to division one episode so feel free to check that out there will be a link in the bottom left hand side of your screen to that so uh, do feel free to check that out if you missed it in your sub boxes earlier of course there's a lot of team of the year stuff going on at the minute but this is this is what the uh, the transfer situation is at the minute i'm trying to move out all of the players you can see on your screen right now, apart from, of course, Lukaku and Torres at the bottom. Diego Costa is moving on. He didn't have a very good season for us, was a waste of money, etc. So I'm trying to get him out of the club. Marco Marin is a player that is surplus to requirements, so he is being moved on as well. And the rest are youth players that I really want. I, they won't get first team football with me, so I want them to still progress as, uh, as individuals, as professionals, as players. So sending them out on loan is the best way to do that. So you saw I just put a bid in for Lucas Maurer. We are looking for a winger. So he is a very, very good prospect. 85 rated already, and he's only 21 so definitely trying to get him in so you can see I, uh, I put an inquiry in for Edinson Cavani and PSG wanted 53 million I'm not gonna offer 53 million so uh, that's been definitely rejected though we are looking for a striker and I would like a striker with pace and good feet if possible so feel free to leave as many uh, suggestions in the comments down below as you uh, as you wish towards uh, new signings we we're looking for like I say for a winger for a striker for a holding mid perhaps for uh, for two strikers it depends if uh, if we can get Diego Costa out or not but uh, Pedro is another player we're looking at as a potential winger although he's 26 I would like to get someone in that's a little bit younger if possible we've had a, an offer for Marco Marin of course we said we wanted to move him on so uh, trying to counter off I want at least value for Marco Marin so uh, we'll have to wait and see what Newcastle come back with but uh, PSG rejected the 18 million pound bid for Lucas Mauro so I raised it by 5 mil hoping that they'd uh, they'd see such a large increase in, uh, in the bid and accept it. So we we'll have to wait and see how that goes. I will have another one of these transfer update videos for you on Friday night. So if you aren't subscribed to the channel, feel free to do so to make sure you don't miss out on any of the FIFA content coming from me over the next few days. There will be a link in the description to do so, an annotation on screen over that subscribe button. And if you missed the Champions League final, there is a link as an annotation over that snippet of gameplay you can see there to that video. And that was one hell of a game. So if you did miss that, feel free to check it out. There will be a link over there. But that's going to wrap this one up, guys. Please feel free to leave the video a like if you could be so kind. Thank you for your continued support on all of the stuff that isn't Team of the Year during this Team of the Year week. I, uh, I really do appreciate it, so long as you know, hopefully we can uh, keep up the uh, the level of interest in the channel, etc. Because I'm not too ultimate team based, but it is good to, it's fantastic to have you guys' support throughout the period. So thank you very much for that. But that's going to bring this one to a close. We'll have uh, England at Rio again tomorrow and a as probably expected, a Team of the Year pack opening tomorrow evening as well, looking for the midfielders. But that's going to bring this to a close. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.